Hello, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good night, and welcome to the... F it's Friday, isn't it? Yeah, Friday stream. It's Friday stream. It's nearly the weekend. It's good. It's all good. Can we have an AV check to get us going here? Welcome back. As a VOD, rightly. Yeah, you should be able to watch the VOD, mate. And it'll also go on Squirrel Plus. Uh, maybe not today. I'm not sure, actually. One second left. Talk about good timing. Noise. AV's good. Mr. Charge Cookie, thank you for 45 months. Straight in there. Anyway, you've had a good week. You had a good day. We're looking forward to weekend farming. The beard's coming. <laughs> you like the beard? It really is coming along, isn't it? It's quick. It's, it's really starting Welcome to show now. Back. Not a... I got unspecified time. I did say to yesterday I wasn't sure when I'd start. I'm here. That's the main thing, right? So I've I've changed my overlay around a little bit, as you may be able to tell. Um, I've tried to make it a little bit more compatible with um, with farming sim, trying not to get in the way of things, as you can see. So I've removed the top strip, moved some logos around, moved the time around. Uh, I've put myself down here next to the map, and then on the right, you can see here, I've got the new farm sim controller that I took out the attic. Or my loft, whatever you want to call it. And um, I should be trying this today. So, yeah, I've got the wheel come up, so you can actually see this thing. So it should be fun. It'll be fun trying this thing. Like, the button mappings are probably completely broken. I've got a page with the default button mappings on it, so I'm going to have to keep referring to this, because I don't know which, <laughs> which button does what. I literally just set this up. So, but it'll be fun. And also... Joining me for today and tomorrow are various members of the team. Uh, Northern Alex may or may not join today or tomorrow. I'm not sure yet. But for now, we've got uh, Jack and Muttley, so let's say hi to them. Jack and Muttley, say hi. Hello. Good afternoon. That jump is extraordinary. Like the, the, the falling off. Like, it used to just jump in a straight line, didn't it? Like... You stood like a board, if I remember. But now it's like... Ah. An improvement on the left leg leap, I think. Yeah, it is, actually. Do you know, I've never I've never seen the jump, because you only see it in multiplayer. It's hilarious. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to do some proper grafting, Alex. Exactly right. We've got things to do. First job is to finish this field off. Um, we're moving time forward now so the crops grow. So we need to finish this field off. Um, if you don't mind, I'll jump in the combine finish this because I want to test the combine. And see if they've... Because uh, oh, okay. there's been a new patch today. Um, so if one of you wants to run trail and the other one can go and start bringing the seed over. That kind of thing. You should all be farm managers so you can buy seed and things. Uh, you, what seed are we going to go with? Is it soybean? Um... I don't think we can harvest a soybean. Oh, can we? I'm not. Can't remember. Not a clue. I'm not sure what we need for that. Not bad, double dude. Thank you, combat. Welcome back. Likes technology. Thank you for six months. Half a year hype. Curly, I don't know, mate. I've literally just started playing the MP. I have no idea. But just bear in mind, this is a pre-release version, so there may be issues. Let me just quickly do that and that. To make my screen a bit bigger here. Happy anniversary, Nata. To that. And we'll put that on there. So I don't miss anything. There we go. Right. You have to admit you couldn't watch the last stream and you're messing things up and not knowing what you were doing. I play farms in all the time, so you haven't played for more than a year, so I'll let you off here. Hey, 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 Misty Mouse, cool. You can't be an expert on everything, mate, can we? Is the pre order discount only for PC version, Firefighter? Um, I don't know. Have a look. Have a click on it and see what it does. I'm not 100% on that. Right, this is going to be fun, because I need to know what the controls are. What's lower? Lower, lift the weight, attach the implement. Maybe that one? It's probably not that one. <laughs> it's probably not that button. That's all the lights. 
I just want to lower this thing. How do we lower it? For signs. Have you tried the one pass cedars like the ones on the front hopper? Not yet. Lower implement, there we go. Well, that didn't work. Uh, you pre-order farms in today, it says it releases on Steam 19th November. It releases at... If you're in the UK, Presley, I think it's 11pm on the 19th. Um, if It's basically midnight European time is when it releases. Right. We're going to go forward. Yes, we are. Okay. Mate, that may have been fixed then. I've got my truck IR turned on as well. Hello from Denmark, Trucker85. Hello, sir. I'm liking the farm wheel. I've only just started using it. I'll let you know as I go along. What is that panel? So, Logitech, SciTech do this farm sim controller here, which is consists of this wheel, two pedals, and this panel. Um, if you run the Farm Sim 19 Commander, from, I've put a link in there for you, so it'll take you to it. I think it's currently on a on like an Amazon Black Friday deal. It's like ninety pounds off at the moment. It's massive, but it is it is a bit plasticky. I will say that. But that panel is actually quite useful, and you can use it on other games as well. So you can use it in trucking, which is interesting because I might actually try that. Yeah, 45% on Amazon. Off at the moment. There's a, there's a link oh, link at yeah. the end there. It says Farm Sim Control. If you click that, it'll show you. Cool, Patrick. Paul, if you... What's that? It looked like you need to get the label maker out to mark the panel. <laughs> I do. I really do. But first, I need to remember. I need to look at that and then decide what controls I want. Because some of the defaults are a bit weird. Uh, the Sussex driver, the side panel is USB, so it it completely standalone. I didn't even need to install a driver; like it just you just plug it in, and it just presents itself as a game controller. So you can use it with any wheel you want, basically. However, the weird thing is, if you look at Amazon, that costs more than the whole thing at the moment because of that discount. <laughs> it's a bit weird. It costs 110 pounds for everything, or 125 for that. Just because of that discount. How do you like using the little knob on the wheel? It's actually, uh, it's handy in combines because you get like one to one rotation. Look, if you look at my screen, the rotation's almost one to one. It's great. Not quite, but it's not bad. You never know, it might be in a Black Friday deal next week. By jokes, you welcome back. Jim Bob, 52 months. Thank you very much, Jim Bob. Come on, keep turning. DT Killen, thank you for subbing. Welcome to the Night House, DT. Can we give him a nutty welcome, guys? Sean MC874, welcome back. Welcome to the house. No different discount in the US. Well, like I say, if you wait till next week, maybe the Black Friday deal will, will present something. I remember dreaming about games like these as a teen. What a time to be alive. Tons and tons of sim games. There really are lots of sim games. 
What I like about farm sim is the co-op nature of it. Yes, Japimon. The, the, the panel is standalone, mate. It'll work with any wheel. It doesn't plug into this. It's completely a standalone. I could unplug this wheel and put a different wheel here and that would just carry on. It has a John Deere toy. <laughs> You bought the CE just to get the toy. Hilarious. Uh, why do they have Black Friday outside the US? The day after US Thanksgiving is the largest shopping day for the US and a Black Friday on the internet as well. Everybody has Black Friday now. Do you know why Black Friday exists though? It's not, it's not so much to do with Thanksgiving. It's more to do with it's been shown statistically to be the day when you get the highest um, amount of internet sales for Christmas. And that's why they put all the sales out that day now because everybody's basically buying for Christmas at that point is that everything yes it is okay we are done here Indeed. Uh, so is that Jack you see though What are you seeding, Jack? Soybean. Hey? The soybean. Ah. Can we harvest a soybean with this header? I'm not sure, but we can always rent if need be. You say it was worth quite a good amount of money, so it seems worth it. It was quite good. I don't know what the yield's like. Are we uh, selling crop? I think. Let's have a look at the prices. What is that? Is that uh, canola? Yeah. Well, the price has gone down at the grain elevator, but it's still fourteen eighty two, so it's still pretty good. We could sell it. Yeah, let's get the money. Okay, grain elevator is. My combine's not empty. Apparently, it's got a little bit left in it. Mm -hmm. Quite a little spinny fan on the side of the combine. Cool. Could you be buying a shed at some point? I don't really have a home for this thing. You were near kind of home base area. Uh, I'll try and bring the game volume down a touch and bring the volumes up a little bit. Where's my Discord? Okay. Let's try that. Yeah, we don't really have a, a home, do we? <laughs> no. Have a field, but we don't really have a home. I know you can buy a farmhouse. Kind of put that down somewhere as your base. Yeah. Um. Look, the trouble is, like, set like eighteen and fifteen are not great in terms of build plot. Like the original build plot bottom right has space around it to put buildings, but this doesn't really. Place Between goals. 19 and 15 is a bit of space if we clear some trees. Cost nine grand for an easy shed, uh, the cheapest one, or 22 for a medium shed. We can get a nine grand shed and put things in it. Don't know how high it is though. Actually, it's quite high. I could put a shed right next to this field if you want. Yeah, sounds good. Terrain is deformed. There we go. Can we put it there? A little bit picky. Bretson, how are you doing? I did pop into your stream, Bretson. I said hi, but you were busy like trying to figure out something on your plane. Looking at the manuals and stuff. What's the keys to move? Oh, there it is. Let's have a look at this end of the field. Happy Actually, maybe this end might be better. Nutter. There's not a lot of wiggle room here. OK. 
Cannot be placed here, the terrain is defined. Depending to rolling in, 16,000 for that. Nice, we're up to 100 grand. Lovely. Had it then, I think it went green then, didn't it? It's not having it. He's trying to fly something I really shouldn't have. <laughs> I think he was having an issue and he was looking at the manual and uh, you figured it out. You were like, yes, and then you walked away. Overweight gaming. Thank you for the host. Can you customize where your animals are going to be? Uh, don't know yet. We're gonna we're gonna try the the animals later once we've got the farm up and running. Hmm. I don't think that's gonna work, is it? Let's try over here. This is the other field that we own. There's a lot of crows on this field. Object collides with an object. Stone the crows. <laughs> I've been putting, I've been trouble putting this thing down actually. It just says it's colliding all the time. From like an overhang of a tree or something. Well, pretty much no matter what I try and put it down, it says collides with an object. You should be able to place it right in the middle of any field we own. I mean, that's not a great place for it, but at least you know that it's not bugging out if you can. Yeah, I can put it down right in the middle of the field, which is not the best right. place. <laughs> yeah. No, but at least we know it's not completely bugged out. Yeah, that's true. We may have to get rid of some of those trees to get this to work properly. It's either that or it's the bushes causing the problem. How do we get rid of those little bushes? Well, plowing seemed to work. I'm, I'm getting the feeling maybe it thinks that the, the bushes are objects, so it says you can't do it. Pretty much, Presley. So, yeah. No dice on that one. No bueno. We'll have to live without that for now. That's fine, we'll just leave the uh, machinery on the field or whatever. Right, I think we need to do some logging and get rid of those trees so we can do something with that land. This yellow is calculating terrain. It just... Most of it's red though and I think the bushes are stopping it. Do you know if these crows have an effect on the like the seed and the crop? I don't think they do. I think they're cosmetic. Right. Okay. Uh, no problem. If you got to go to school, bro. See you later. Still more working now. Well, this wheel's working. I think my G twenty seven had issues. Electric Freddy, welcome back. Uh, friends for 25 months. Hope all is well. Wish I had a slow rate to grow... Uh, wish I had a slow rate to grow a beard. I'm three weeks in. I can already grab a handful. Wow. <laughs> you just gotta trim it. You're gonna try some homemade Nando's Peri Peri Chicken. Ooh. I like the Nando's sauce. It's nice. The peri peri salt is really nice as well, Bretson. Have you ever tried that? I don't know, Rob Jensen. It synchronized at the start when um, they got in, but it wasn't. It didn't take very long at all. Thank you, Commander Dub. The wrench icon next to the fuel level. Um, I think that's the repair state. Happy 
I don't know. I've not tried to cut a tree down that I didn't own. I would. Get, I think not, actually. Actually, I'm pretty certain you have to own the land. Right. This will have to be our parking bay for now. Right then, Mr. Mutley. Um, Shall we swap? Trying to think how we're going to do this. The stump cutter's over here. Have you got anything on the front here you have, haven't you? Yeah, I've got the the uh, log pick. That's what we need on the tractor, really. Would you want to take this and I'll hire a small little weathering? Um, yes. Yeah, well, actually, we need to drag this... Um, Actually, we're not going to chip, are we? Oh, yeah, this is the point. I've got a chipper now, but I don't have a, anything to carry logs on. Logs pays more money than the chipper, but I think I bought this chipper. You rented a man log truck yesterday. Does contracts work in multiplayer? Let's have a look. Yes, they do. So, yeah, the contracts do work in multiplayer, somebody was asking. Which is good, because it means people, if they've got nothing to do, then they can just go and do a contract. Yeah, I sent the MAN truck back. It's true. Um, Magdia, keep up the... Keep it up, Paul, of every bit. Thank you for three months. I can't say your name. I really can't. Magdia. I have no idea how to pronounce that. I'm sorry. Actually, for only two years, Golden Acorn. What an adventure. UK to Canada. Loving every minute and loving all the chill streams. Thanks very much. Thanks for two years, bro. Is there any sinking? Well, when they joined, we had some sinking, but it took like 10 seconds or something. That's all I know right now. Right, Motley, so what's the plan? Well, well you're going to take this tractor. I'm going to hire a small... Because uh, we've got a plow. Uh, this has been done in it, so we've got that tree to move, and we need to get a little tractor to run the stump. Well, Oopsie. I'm nearly done if you need a third set of hands. How do you move the arm up and down on this thing? Motley sounds like a geezer. <laughs> Jet Logistics, 14 months already. Grumpy forever, oh, welcome to the house. Yeah. Thank you for your support, Grumpy. No no name, welcome back. Yeah, if you look top left, like, I know this button here switches between the different attach attachments. You can see top left there. So this definitely goes to the tractor. Um, but when I'm in the combine stuff, this doesn't do camera but for some reason it's now doing camera I would have thought that it should do the arm Commander Derp um, it's a farm sim controller mate that you can get for farming see that should do camera which it does this one is not doing anything the grey button near the red or well, this one Oh, that's interesting. So that's like a mode switch. So that goes... Nice. That's actually quite handy. You know, thinking about it, you guys aren't too far from the train tracks. And there's a log car on the train. See so you thinking we load logs onto the car train? Yeah, and then take it round to the sawmill because there's tracks. The tracks go right next to the sawmill. Well, just bear in mind we have no oh, yeah, yeah. log trailer at the moment. Negative Nancy with three months. My day can't get any better. Three months of farming. Who's playing? Captain Jack and Mutley at the moment. Later on, Mad Mick will be joining. 
Somia will join him later on. Muck will be disappearing to do some modding. Mabel will get Northern Alex in, but I've not heard back yet. Right, so let's go for... So if I press that to there and press that one... Uh, huh. So yeah, depending on what I've selected, press that button, it detaches. You buying something there, aren't you? Uh, I'm gonna lease a little tractor to put the stamp trailer on. Yeah, another nice. Nice. Well, he might be awake, but he might have work to do first. Just remember that we have one golden rule on this farm. If you see a speed limit sign, you knock it over. We don't need speed limit. Yeah. <laughs> That's 15 seated. Um. So, okay, so what we're doing, monthly chipping or logging? Uh, we can do either. Well, let's just chip them away and get rid of these trees for now, shall we? While we've got the equipment. Nope. Let's put that there. You do that in ETS too? Well, this is true. <laughs> Gotta be consistent, right? The bush is removable. As far as I can tell, they probably are removable from it if you edit the farm. But if you're as a player, the only way I've found yet to get rid of them is to plow through it. Um, but that's not to say there isn't another way. That's the only way I've found. Like, I couldn't chainsaw them. I don't know, Jake, bro. I think it's because you're already primed to somebody else, maybe. Pepsi Fever. Love your streams. Keep up the good work. Thank you for the bits, Pepsi. Appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, Kyle, what's that? Kyle and, Kyle and Clark in five. Thank you very much for your sub. Welcome to the house, Kyle. That should do it, shouldn't it? You've not used this yet, I don't know, Jay. I assume you're trying to use your prime sub, so I'm thinking it's just what it's been used somewhere else. Right. Uh I'll do this. Turn on the wood crusher, pipe out. Why do you have a dead zone on the wheel? Uh, I have a 4% dead zone on all the axes. Should be good there. Mostly because I didn't know which axis this was. Like it goes axis 1, 2, 3, 4, and I'm like, I don't know which axis that is. I wanna, I'd, li I'd like to have no dead zone on this, but I don't know if that's axis 1 or not. Are you cutting them, Jack? Uh, yeah, right. Point some trees out. What do you want, kind? Any one straight ahead, maybe? Yep. These bushes are really annoying. They make it so hard to see what you're doing. Crazy gigs, how you doing? Stream of blind must miss my delivery. I didn't miss it. I just didn't read it. I did see it, and then I mentioned your name, and then forgot to read it. 
Squirrel, how's the farm wheel and side panel feel? We'll yeah, be able to join soon. Tip, you can use the joystick questions. on the side panel for the loaders. Uh, use the joystick on the side panel for the loaders. The button on top switch between the camera and arm actions. Yes, I know that now. Thank you. <laughs> this, I like. I like this panel. It, it fits on really well. It's USB, it's standalone. And I like all the buttons and I like this control. This and the pedals, a little bit too plasticky for me. So, I like that. I'm not sure about this. It's got some handy controls on it, but it's a bit plasticky. Satu, thank you for half a year. But the thing is, these sell yeah, on their yeah. own. There you go, so you could use this with any wheel you want. But at the moment, on Amazon, the whole package is cheaper than just that. That's why you bought just a side panel. I'm not surprised. On Amazon UK, you that's know, £125 pounds right now. <clears throat> the whole thing, 110 <laughs> Because it's on a sale. Sorry, Jack, what do you say? You can come around the back of this tree and grab this big uh, branch bit. Find your way around. Have you stripped all the bits off it? This one's cut down as yeah, as far as I can get it. Yeah. Just kind of hard to see the rest of all the bushes and stuff. Try and clump it from the top. Oh, there's one twig still on it. <laughs> you missed the bit. And they were really thinking you were pro at this gen. Whatever gave you that idea? <laughs> <laughs> the tricky bit is getting this thing to be accepted by the chipper. There's a tree over here in the way as well. My back wheel's on it now, Jack. I'm coming. Oh, that nearly tipped me into it. Is that okay. lined up? Uh, do you have to replant the trees as well? I am not sure at this stage on Farm Sim 19. Let's see if we can push this thing in. It's a chipper on. Yep, I've switched on. She's not taking it. I think it needs another nudge. There you go. There you go. Turn! It's got it. Nice. Okay, so what's the next one? Um, if you can see it, it's not easy to see. around the back here. Right, just uh, if you can see me. Yeah. How I'm many... stood on. There's a couple of bits here, but it's the lower bit if you can get into it. The lower one, okay. Let me try and take this big one out of the way. Chat needs a big sign saying over here, not joking. So I've got something. 
Oh yeah, you've got something, all right. <laughs> I've got. Let's take this out to the field a little bit. Yeah. Try and do something with this thing. That's freed up the other bit as well, nicely. I lower this. Can you see if you can strim it a bit? Yep, I'm gonna have it now. Might have to chop some branches off. Uh, Pepsi Fever, loving your streams. Um, thank you, dude. Thank you for the bits. Sa uh, Mr. Sato and Cactilast. Cactilast, 23 months. Very close to two years. Thank you, Cactilast. Golden Acorn Hive. Okay, that. Need some beacon action. Hang on, I've got buttons for that. That's it. No, that's that one. That's the uh, hazards. That's hazards. What's that one do? There's, ba there's bacon more. 13. 13 for bacon. Hang on, that should be a bit better. Uh, oh, okay, you've taken <laughs> that bit. Hang on. Um, this bit that's just fallen down, that bit's good to go. Yeah, let's try and put this twig in. Press 13 for bacon, guys. Extra crispy. Does that look like it's going in? Um, no. It needs to be in more of a, uh, an angle. You need to come in at about 2 o'clock. Yeah, more like that. Keep going, keep going, keep going. And there. Yep, should go in. There you go. Yeah, kick a little. Okay, there's this big bit here. Extra crispy, 28, 38 months, did someone say bacon? They did. Good bit. And then there's this little bit. Bag. It's like one of those crane machines in an arcade. I nearly got a soft tie. Oh no, I didn't. <laughs> oh my life, come on. Here you go. What happens if we put Jack in the chip on? Does nothing happen, or do you get small jacks running around? <laughs> what the heck, Snokes? 